if you access streaming sites on your Fire Stick or your Android TV device, probably the biggest issue you're going to have is adverts because as you can imagine, for these websites to offer free streaming content, the way they make their money back is through advertisements. And as you can just see on this uh, hockey website, we have a, a video based advert over here. We have another advert on the left. There's a big advert on the top. Scrolling down, you have another big advert here, another advert there, another advert from the bottom. It literally is just plagued with adverts. So wouldn't it be great if we could apply a simple tweak to your browser on your Amazon device and with this simple trick, you'll now block all of these adverts, these pop-up adverts, these video-based adverts, but also trackers. So you'll end up with a much faster, safer, and more private browsing experience. So please do take a moment to hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. So I'm doing my demonstration on the new 4K Fire Stick Max, but you can follow this process on any other Amazon device where you can install the Silk browser. Now, the reason I'm mentioning the Silk browser is it's a very, very popular browser and many people do use this browser to access streaming sites or streaming websites. Okay, so to start the process, open up your Silk browser. If you now press the context key, which is one with the three lines, go to the top, move over to the menu option. Let's click on that. Inside the menu, let's now scroll down. And we're looking for the settings option. Let's click on that. Inside settings, let's scroll down. And where it says privacy and security, let's click on that. Scroll down, we have an option for use secure DNS. Let's click on that. Now essentially what's happening here is if I just move my face out of the way, we want to turn this option on, which says I want to use secure DNS. Let's click on that. But the key thing here is by default, it's still going to use my ISP's DNS servers, but what we're looking for is to use some custom DNS servers, which basically block all adverts, all trackers by default. Now the way we do that, if you click on choose another provider, let's click on that. We can now click on customize and it does have some other DNS servers you could use, but we want to use the best ad blocking DNS server, which in my opinion is AdGuard. So let's go to the top and click on where it says customized. I can now scroll down and where it says provider URL, let's click on that. And it now wants me to enter in a URL to use for that custom DNS server. And the address for that is just HTTPS, Let's type that in and then let's do a colon. Then we're going to do two forward slashes and then we type in the word DNS dot, then the word adguard, adguard.com. And guys, if I'm going too fast, please just pause the video so you can get this address down. So adguard.com. And then one final thing, we're going to do a forward slash and then type in the word DNS hyphen query. So DNS and then do a hyphen, which is just this one here. And then the word query, here we are. So just one more time. So HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash DNS dot adguard.com forward slash DNS hyphen query. Once you've done that, let's now click on next. That's fine. Now, if you do have a typo in here, it will actually come up in red if it doesn't recognize the address. But as we can see, I have no errors, nothing written in red. I can now press the back button and we can see the skill DNS is now on. And one last thing, we just change the option here to where it says do not track. Let's also turn that on just to be extra secure. No website should now be able to track what we're doing, especially with these free streaming sites. I mean, if you look at some of the, the data they try and collect or some of the trackers they use, you'll be shocked. So let's leave that to on. Let's press back, press back again, back one more time. Let's now try that same hockey site again. Click on that. And what do we see now, guys? The page loads. I can scroll down. 
zero adverts. So do give a thumbs up for that. And in fact, if I scroll down, just to confirm that going through this entire page now, which was literally plagued with adverts, I can now access this page, access all of the content on the page with zero adverts. And let's do one more site just to confirm that it's working across any of these websites, any of these streaming sites or free sites. Uh, let's try another one, which definitely had loads of adverts before. Uh, this one here. Again, the website loads, scroll down. And what do we see? Zero adverts, no interruptions, no pop-ups, none of those video-based adverts. I can now enjoy all of these streaming sites across all of my devices, absolutely free and now ad free. And just before you go guys, just a quick word from one of our channel partners, IP Vanish are now doing a special offer where you can get complete protection for all of your devices, your Fire Sticks, your phones, your tablets, your Android TV devices can get complete protection with really fast speeds with confirmed zero data logging at just $3.99 a month. So at that price to get maximum protection with complete privacy, I definitely think it's worthwhile checking out. So really appreciate your support. Do like and share this video and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.